I kissed the dawn and I liked it. It tasted like Piscovirus. Good morning, guys. So I am back at the Minneapolis airport. I really, every time I'm here, I think that I should just buy a condo here. I think they have condos here. But anyway, I'm on my way to Toronto for the Canadian Reptile Breeders Expo. It is going to be a blast, but something miraculous just happened. I'm actually early. Usually I get here and race through security and race to the gate. I can actually just sit here and watch the world go by for an hour. Good morning. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? Great, thanks Mr. Crawford. Awesome, thank you. Boarding, next stop Toronto. Good, man. Good to see you. Um, yeah, so that's kind of heavy. All I have in there is a change of undies. All right, so after a very short drive from the airport, we have finally arrived at the International Center. This is where the expo is going to be held. Let's check this place out. Wow, this is amazing. What is it for? Look at that. Yeah, this is enormous. Oh, and you got a, a petting zoo with python food. Not part of the oh, that's not what that is? Oh. Ah, look who's here! What's up, brother? How the hell are you doing? Good to see you, man. Oh, spotted the wild bill. <laughs> oh, man. Good to see ya. It's good to see you, too, dude. Oh, look at this, guys. Hi, buddy. All right, so this is where I live for the weekend. Not a bad view. All right guys, so I've checked into the hotel. It's a pretty swanky place, thank you Grant, but for right now, I've gotta change my clothes, and yes, I'm sporting the Iguana Fest t-shirt again, this is my favorite t-shirt, because Ryan, Bill, and Eric and I are going to the greatest reptile zoo in Ontario. Right? Right! Right? Let's do it! Yes! Hell yeah. Hop in, brother. All right, I'll get in on the other side. Hey. So this is the place, Reptilia. We are getting a private behind the scenes tour here. Huh? La, da, da. Look at this place, guys. I am gonna say this and I really think that it's the truth. This is the coolest reptile zoo. Why do I always do this with my hand? This is the coolest reptile zoo in the world. That is a monster sulcata. I kissed the dawn and I liked it. It tasted like Piscivorous. I want to live in this place. Bill, yes? Yes, this place is amazing. Yes. The cages are so, I can't, I can't even call them cages. No, they're enclosures. The enclosures they're are they're so habitats. Beautiful. They're These aren't cages, they're exhibits. habitats. 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 Habit exhibits, they're exhibits. Yes. The 
eyes and there's blood. That's a nice blood. Those are so neat. I mean, they're pretty darn long when they hatch, but they've been growing pretty steady. Oh my goodness, they're beautiful. Oh, he's just like a big baby. Can you show his belly? He's got a big belly. And he's awesome too, so he'll come out in the morning and he'll walk around on the floor and he'll uh, uh, we basically don't even have to pick him up. We open the door and he'll come over. They'll come the right out, huh? Kind of take, take him down, what a honey! Oh, very brave. You grabbed the ball. Oh, wow. Whoa. We had an enormous burger. We had a bird about this size, and they were nowhere near the same. Wow. Those are big spurs. Yeah, female, right? No. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, check this out. This is how turtles sleep. He's totally sleeping underwater, and that makes it really hard for turtles to snore. All right, all right, I'll, I'll, I'll move on. Guys, look at this display. The attention to detail in these displays is just absolutely amazing. Look at this place. So there's a spitter in there. Wow. Seriously, guys, the attention to detail in these enclosures. Look at this one. Absolutely amazing. So you said that a lot of the animals that you guys have here were taken in as rescues or surrenders? Yep, that's right. So the vast majority of our animals here are non-releasable. They were either surrendered by members of the public, they were caught by animal services, or otherwise confiscated. So hearing that the majority of the animals here are rescues, that gives me such a huge and, and, and even more appreciation for this place. That is incredible. I didn't know that. Most of these animals in here are rescues. and. Look at the homes that they provide here. Absolutely incredible. All right, guys, so that's the part. All right. All right, guys, so this was the public part of the zoo. In here is behind the scenes. All right, guys, we're going in this enclosure. If I don't fall and kill myself, but this is where the giant gators are. Now this floor is very slippery. Hi, Gator. Who's a piggy? Who's a piggy? Who's a piggy? A buck. So when you're inside these enclosures is when you really get an appreciation for the attention to detail that went into creating all these exhibits. Look at this. Right down to the simulated golf course. Oh, so slippery. Okay, I got it, I got it. There we go, okay, I got it. Ah, success. Awesome. All right, so where are we going next? Um, we can go take a look at see if the box is still by that window. Yeah, fantastic. Fantastic cross. All right. All right, guys. So here are the Nile crocodiles. We're gonna stick our head in there. Hi guys! They're so chill. Last time I was here, I did this and I mean, they did exactly that. They didn't move. <laughs> and it, it actually gives kind of a false sense of security. Yeah, well they uh, did a bunch of huffing and puffing when I first opened the door. So. Wow. Nice. All right, Bite is here. Yeah. Oh, Bite is here. Rock, Bite is here. Yeah. like, oh, hey, cool. He's like, man, we're cool. No, we're cool now. All right, make a silly joke and see if you'll laugh. 
What did, what did the grad student get when they crossed a cow and an octopus? A message from the Ethics Review Board. But um, uh, Silence. Yeah. Crickets. Sometimes, sometimes he laughs at things. Usually he does. What? Um, yes. this bird just took a dump on my Iguana Fest shirt. Yep. It is time for the bird to go in with the crocodiles. Come on. Going back to the crocodiles. She, she I'm out. making such a bigger deal out of this than it really needs Dude, to be. Live your life covered in But crap. it's my Iguana Fest shirt. He comes out of the water. Oh, I know, I know. I'm <laughs> totally. She just left on you. Totally kidding. You, you know how many before? animals have taken a poop on this t shirt and I am yet to wash it? So the bird poop, it's no big deal. Rosie, thank you so much for this tour. That was just yeah. awesome. Thanks for coming. I get a handshake, Ryan gets a hug. Alright guys, so that was an amazing day here at Reptilia, setting up, flying all the way here to Toronto. Tomorrow is the actual expo, so I'm going to take you guys with me. So until then, love the planet, keep your life in balance, and rattle on.